Dr. Effer's work as far as stopping the heart affects patients every day around the world who have heart surgery. Initially, we didn't know how to protect the heart when we stop it. Now we know we can stop the heart for up to six hours with the modern medications we use. So we have lots of time to do very complex operations. When we do a aortic valve or mitral valve, whether that's repairs or replacements, we stop the heart. On top of that, most patients we do coronary artery bypass surgery on nowadays, we will also stop the heart. As far as the transplantation side, that has grown tremendously. The first heart transplant was done in December of 67, and there was a lot of interest in doing this in the United States and in 1968 that was done here at the Cleveland Clinic. We are now the biggest center for lung transplants in the United States and for heart transplants we are among the three or four that have reached that milestone of 2,000 heart transplants. These patients, the prognosis is very poor without some surgical treatment and they can now return to their families and enjoy a much better quality of life.